Picture this. An ordinary day at a bustling shopping center in Sydney, Australia, suddenly shattering into a moment of chilling horror. April 13th, 2024, will forever be etched in the annals of Australian history as a day of profound tragedy. A day when the peaceful humdrum of life was brutally interrupted by a knife-wielding assailant, leaving a trail of death and devastation in his wake. The assailant, later identified as 40-year-old Joel Couchy, unleashed a deadly attack within the crowded shopping center. He single-handedly turned a place of joy and commerce into a scene straight out of a nightmare. The attack resulted in the tragic loss of six innocent lives, and several others were left nursing injuries. Among the injured was a small child, a stark reminder of the indiscriminate nature of such heinous acts. Without missing a beat, the police responded to the distressing scene. In the ensuing chaos, one brave officer made the ultimate decision, shooting and killing Couchy, thereby ending the bloodshed. The swift action of the police, however, could not erase the horror that had unfolded. In the aftermath, Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese expressed his condolences to the bereaved families. To honor the victims, an impromptu memorial sprang up at Bondi Junction. A sea of flowers, a symbol of the collective grief of a nation, was laid in remembrance. Premier Chris Minns and Police Commissioner Karen Webb addressed the media, their faces etched with the gravity of the situation. As the dust settled, police investigators scoured the crime scene, piecing together the grim puzzle. Notes of love and loss were left alongside the flower tributes, each one a poignant reminder of the lives abruptly snuffed out. In summary, this tragic incident at the Sydney Shopping Centre has left a nation grappling with shock and grief. The loss of six lives at the hands of Joel Couchy, the swift police response and the aftermath of mourning, have painted a somber picture. As the nation mourns, it is a stark reminder of the fragility of life and the courage we must summon to face such adversity. Yet, in the heart of this tragedy, the spirit of solidarity and resilience shines through a testament to the indomitable Australian spirit.